Listen, listen. I don't care how you get rid of this guy, okay? Just do it. This could end us. No, I'm not saying murder him. Are you kidding me? Just get rid of him or this whole city will tear itself apart. Matter of fact, I'll talk to him myself. What was his name again? You alright? You good? You awake? Can I stop doing this? Hey man, you good? Who are you? Where am I? Uh, uh, my name is Reggie. I'm an envoy. Your envoy. What's that you ask? Well, I'm a spirit that is trained to guide ghosts like you to the afterlife under the condition that you right those you have wronged. Ghosts? Wrong? You saying that car crash killed him? Yeah, that's a backwards and forwards, is it? Uh, so, let's just cut to the chase and stuck in limbo. Uh, which bloke, which bloke did you slap? That rat. Alright, okay. What's your name? Damien. Dime. Rack off with the venom, Dime. You're technically the perpetrator in this situation. And unless you put your feelings aside, I'm not going to be able to help you. So, I ask again, which bloke did you slap? You ruined my life. You ruined your life? Oh. Alright, we're not getting anywhere with this. Uh, don't worry, Dime. This is gonna, just going to be a... Quick few seconds, I'm just gonna probe your memories and uh, I'll extract the information I need so I can get the proper context of your situation. Sound good? Orderly, that makes my job easier. I've never allowed you to do this. Get out of my head. Yeah, yeah, spit the dummy all the way. You brought this on yourself. Stop, or I'll kick you out. Give it a burl, see what that gets you. Ah, your higher society. So, uh, can you explain who these whackers are? Fine. I was the governor of Arkansas. I was running for re-election. One of my employees, Carl Tacey, wanted to get his 15 minutes of fame and sabotage my campaign. Okay. I get a funny feeling you're not telling me the whole story. Right. What about these guys? Like I said, Carl is the one in the camera footage of the third photo. The man showing me him is my loyal campaign manager, Mickey Schrader. Alright, uh-huh. Spit it out. The other guy is one of my friends who helped me get into office in exchange for some money. That's my boy. Alright, truth sets you free, doesn't it? Now, here's our game plan. Uh, we're gonna go to Mickey's house and just poltergeist him into giving away his giving away your campaign's faults and misdeeds, give back the money you stole and all that, and then we'll be on our merry way. How's that sound? I hate this. You should be the one in this situation, not me. Damn, there's really no point in dying on this hill. At this point, you only have two options. Uh, you can just, you can do the task or be stuck in limbo. To me, that's a pretty, that's a pretty shoddy afterlife. So, let's bounce. Fine, let's just do this. All right. Just need to get Mickey's address. Let's go. Mr. Fraser, Mr. Fraser, is everything all right, Mr. Fraser? Oh, all right. uh, I forgot to mention this, but since we're in limbo, right? And that's like a different plane of existence. So uh, time doesn't really flow down here like it normally does. Interesting. But look in the mirror directly, dipstick. You'll get yourself trapped. This is supposed to be just an easy in and out. Uh, just go possess something and talk to me. Shit. Hurry, now's your chance. Mickey. Mr. Fraser? Down here. Oh, no, 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 I'm seeing things. This isn't real. I can assure you that this is the most certainly real, Mickey, and I need your help. At the moment, I'm dead and can't truly rest in peace until I undo all the damage I've done. Get to the point, Dime. Oh, uh, slow down, slow down. I need a second to take this in. There's no time to slow down, Mickey. I'm still your boss, and therefore you do as I say. Come here. Okay. There you are, you rat. I'm coming for you. I'm, I'm in big trouble if Dime actually kills that boy. Uh, what, what was that spell that gets me out of situations like this? I should pay more attention to class. I don't even know what's coming to you, Carl. I'm gonna revel in your despair. Hey, Reg, come on, think, Reg. What was that spell? What was that spell? Uh, ha, got it. <laughs> 
Nice. Uh, where are you, Carl? Gotcha. Chill out, I'm coming! What's the matter with you? You're trying to break? <gasps> Did you really think you could ruin my whole political career and get away with it, Tacey? Mr. Schrader? What are you doing here? Why are you trying to kill me? Don't recognize me? Ring any bells? You! Yeah, me. You're gonna pay for what you did to me, Tacey. I'll rip you limb from limb until you feel the pain and misery you've caused me. Wait, 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 wait! You know, Don, I gave you plenty of chances to redeem yourself. And this is what you do with it? After this, I'm done with you. I hereby sentence you to becoming a lost soul until you see the error of your ways. Am I clear? Yes, Reg. Loud and clear. Bonzo. Who are you? Okay, I know the situation's weird and scary, but trust me, this is gonna make for a great story for parties. <laughs>